Hello, third graders. This is our special online lesson. This would be our normal lesson for this week. And we're going to be learning about a song from another country. Let's learn. So our I can statements are, I can recognize me, Ray Doe, patterns in music. And I can read notation on a staff. So the first song we're going to listen to is a song called Kumasan. I want you to take a listen and tell me what do you think Kumasan means? That's right, Kumasan means bear, the honorable bear, and the song is in Japanese. Now, what do you think this song is actually about? Well, it is a jump rope game. So when people play games with jump ropes and they have to count or a certain number of letters or jump a certain number of times, this time, though, they have moves that you have to do in order to do the jump rope game. So the moves are pretty simple. They're the moves from the song. So they have uh, turn yourself around, so turn around in a circle. Then they have put your hands on the ground, so you've touched the ground with your hands. And then they have jump with one foot in the air. And then at the end, sayonara, which is uh, a long way of saying sayonara, is goodbye, so you wave. So you can now do that movement with the song again. So how many pitches are in this song? There are three. There was a low sound, a middle sound, and a high sound. So there were three pitches in our song. So now what I want you to do is I want you to move your hands up and down your body to show the high, middle, and low sounds. So you're going to start low sound is going to be on your waist. The high sound is going to be... In, on your uh, head, and the middle song is going to be on your shoulders. So low, middle, and high. Go ahead and jump back in the song and do it now. All right, so what you're going to do now is you're going to practice those words, and you're going to get to hum the melody. So let, and then uh, I sing the whole song. You can go back as many times as you need to learn the song. Here we go. So pitches are written on a staff that have five lines and four spaces. The lines on a staff are numbered from the bottom up. What number is on the top space? How about the top line? 
So the top space, we have one, two, three, four. Top line, one, two, three, four, five. So five lines, four spaces. This staff shows the three pitches used in Kumasan. The notes were Do, Re, and Mi. What line or space is the uh, Re on? It is on the second line. How about Do and Mi? They are on spaces on the first and second space. So now we're going to jump back to an old song, Rocky Mountain, and we're going to get to follow along with the notes on the staff now. So please follow along with the music. Can you find the three pitches from Kumasan in the song? There they are, right at the end. Do remember me, 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 re, re, do. So what I'd like you to do now is we're going to go ahead and practice this song as well. So practice the new words and the melody for the verses. We've already learned the refrain previously, but now you can learn the verses. Take as much time as you need. Rocky Mountain, Rocky Mountain, Rocky Mountain High 